Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we checked the video. That's, that's incredible. <laughs> we checked the video and the back was open the entire time. We've been driving around Sterling, Scotland with the back of the car open. <laughs> Who finally noticed? Did you notice that? Sterling, Scotland, and some of the people I love from the place. And as always, thanks for watching this episode of Matt's Rat Show. Today, Ashley and I headed to church with my old host family. They've become like a real family to me, and I was super excited to be staying with them again, even for just a few days. These are some of the streets of Sterling. They're absolutely amazing. Imagine being here for an entire year, and the only way I was able to get around was by riding a bike or walking. It's safe to say I did some major exploring when I lived here, and I loved it. Here we are in Sterling, Scotland. Day one, Sterling. Going into shops and keys and seeing the history. My old stomping grounds. Headed to church. Here we are. Yep, that was still, that was called Willie Walsh. Old staircase. <laughs> Watching Matt Red Show. On YouTube here, a vlog of us watching a vlog. <laughs> awesome. It's like two worlds coming together. Watch vlog, it? watching a vlog, wizard mail time. When I got the wizard mail time. Oh yeah, in the garage. Yeah, I've gotten that on video. It's like absolute chaos just broke out. <laughs> so he's like, he's using the force. Use the force. today in the Church of the Holy Rood. We're hoping to tour the castle maybe later today or maybe tomorrow or Wednesday. There's just so much to see, so little time. But the nice thing about Scotland is no matter where you're at, it's beautiful to look at. <laughs> so you really, once you're here, you're good. Through here. 
It's very difficult to remind yourself to look the opposite direction that you're used to looking when you cross the road. Because you look the direction you're used to when you're crossing the road and you're like, oh, it's fine. Yeah. And then you look the other direction just for, you know, just to be safe. And you're like, oh, that's actually the direction I'm supposed to look. And you save yourself from almost dying multiple times. <laughs> just kind of walk around Sterling and take in the music. What's been your favorite part so far, hon? Of Scotland. Of Scotland? Uh, besides, oh. besides the people, of course. Besides Because yeah. the heart of any country, if Epcot movies have taught us anything, that the heart of any country is its people. Huh? Yeah. Anybody with me? Epcot movies? But the real heart of filling the country is its people. Scotland? <laughs> Mm -hmm. We're off to get a wee chippy with a young lady named Ruth, who I worked with when I was over here in Scotland, so that'll be fun. A proper fish and chips. That's my wee wife back there, sneaking up on me. Actually been walking around Sterling all day today. Went over to Bridge of Allen, got a wee chippy, went to the William Wallace Monument, saw all kinds of amazing things. We're just about beat. How do we get the ice cream out of them? Huh? cruising through the town center. Yeah, Monday. Everything's closed down. Everyone's home for tea. Hey, there you are, Ashley. Ready? There's Ashley. Look at this guy's eyes. <laughs> I wonder if someone painted that on there. Oh, that was pretty neat. It's a big clock tower. Bannockburn. The fields of Bannockburn. In the middle of this mall, we've got this piece of the old world that they kept. Crazy, just in this mall, and then 
in the mall is this old piece of the uh, the old city walls, and this was just like this random spot. Read it. Read it. Read it. What are you doing, boys? What are Hi. You doing? Hi. Oh, <laughs> Food. <laughs> Food. <laughs> Say something in Scottish. Say something in Scottish. Is it a, is it a language? <laughs> okay, I didn't get it with I guess I am brew. I guess I am brew. <laughs> I'm gonna be on the internet. <laughs> I'm gonna be on the internet. Hi! <laughs> I'm just gonna duck face every time it goes on these levels. So fat. <laughs> It's actually on me right now. Oh. Well, and I'm meeting with some old friends from my time when I lived here in Scotland. Hanging out, enjoying life. Say hi, everyone. Say something in your best American accent. Oh my god. Like Tiffany and Oh my god. Did you hear that? Uh, she thinks Brian is into her? Oh my totally god. Totally not. I can't believe her. Greetings, America. How are you doing? Hi, Tiffany. I like you. I don't like your friends then, but I like you. Hi, Tiffany. 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 Well, I, between um, the vloggings and the lack of internet and not getting shades, it's pretty good. Yeah, it's pretty good. No sense of No TV. No Chipotle. But we're still fine. What is in Iron Brew, Johnny? What, what's the secret ingredient? I sacred nectar of the gods. My dad told me it was like rust and dripping from iron poles when I was younger. That's what he told me. My dad told me. Iron brew. Rust dripping. It might be unicorn blood. Unicorn blood. Tastes good though. My food tastes good. Ah, it's great, good. Oh, are you videoing? Right? This is video now. Yes, yeah. <laughs> you get used to it, but then you just roll with it. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, just me hugging his body. Bye, love you, dude. Missed you, bud. Come see us in Minnesota. Give my best to your wifey. See you, Mark. That's Mark. How are you, buddy? So plug your channel. Plug your channel. I don't really have a channel. You don't have a channel. We are <laughs> 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 I love roads and I love pizza. <laughs>
<laughs> Road trip pizza! <laughs> this is where you can see how much our one-way system sucks. Yeah, the one-way streets have changed, I think, since I was station, here. The station's right there. <laughs> and we're going all the way up and right. Oh, Yesterday, we went to go have a chippy at the Bridge of Allen. Oh, it's so good. It's so amazing. Oh, I was like, I have to do that at least once, maybe four times while I'm here. <laughs> I mean, if you don't want, if you don't want pizza, man, I can definitely go there. Yeah, I'd be, I'd be down with whatever. So, yeah, it was so amazing. It was just as good as I remember. <laughs> you yeah. We don't see any kids there because the school's going back today. Summer holidays are. All right. Has it been open the whole way? I don't think it's been open the whole way. Is the back end? Well, I've got video. We'll check the video. <laughs> I, so we checked the video. That's incredible. <laughs> we checked the video. The back was open the entire time. We've been driving around Sterling, Scotland with the back of the car open. <laughs> Who finally noticed? Did you notice that? Yeah. <laughs> what terrible drivers don't even notice that his car is open? I live in Scotland. There's just these random cannons on the side of the street. <laughs> I freak out every time I see a car on the other side of the road. Then Sorry, I didn't tell you my brakes don't really work in this car, so we're gonna have to take this corner full speed. All right, no, let's no. do it. <laughs> I'll throw my with my boot open. <laughs> we either have to compromise and have the boot open if my brakes work, or shut it's the like boot. An air brake. <laughs> That's, <laughs> an air That's brake. unbelievable. <laughs> I'm so glad that I, I was filming too. I'm just gonna. <laughs> Just go up and pass a police car with pass Mark. <laughs> pull us over and ticket us. <laughs> Just hanging out with Mark please. and now he's gonna have to pull us over. Please officer. Mark's the policeman over here. That's so I kinda wanna get pulled over by Mark. Be fun. <laughs> <laughs> We should. I heard a ruckus. We should, we should totally go like 100 miles an hour on the motorway, get pulled over. And go, I'm waiting for my friend Officer Chance. <laughs> I, ref I, ref I refuse to get out of my car until I've spoken to Officer Chance. He's a professional officer in the I'm sure you must know him. Yes, 57 year old Officer Anderson. I refuse to get out of the car until I've spoken to Officer Chance. He's on probation for I only speak. Speak with Officer Chance. Otherwise, I want a lawyer. <laughs> I am not above the law, but my friend is the law. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm equal with it. Uh, pretty much makes me your master. <laughs> I am your overlord. I am your overlord. Uh, funny. Everything is just so freaking picturesque. I can't stop taking pictures of everything. Either way, it's fine. Oh, don't film sideways. What you like? You and my wife, and you film sideways. Germany cricket. I don't want to leave Scotland. I want to stay. Me too. I've perfected my wee accent. Well, at least I think I have. Yeah. I suppose that has probably many people out there from Scotland that would be like, your accent's rubbish, mate. Yeah. Don't you know? It's a wee Scottish Minnesota accent, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Scottish man saying, we've done what you like. Oh aye, time to go home. Yeah. Time to go home tomorrow. Okay, bye. Ciao. Ciao. Ciao, ciao. So many the wee vines. It's time to go home. We're walking back for our last night in Scotland and it's an early flight in the morning tomorrow. So we've got to say goodbye to Scotland. It's a very sad day. Very sad day. We have to come back soon, hun. It can't be 10 years again until I make it back. It was a wonderful trip, wonderful time. I absolutely loved seeing everyone that I saw. Again, all my friends from Scotland and all of the scenery, historic sites I went to. We had loads of fun in Scotland. Dun, dun. Uh, a wee family photo. <laughs> I will 
never forget my time in Scotland. The year I spent living there, the places I explored, but more importantly, the people I met along the way. All of them have become a part of me in some way. The laughter we shared, the places we went to, the perspectives they taught me. Scotland is one of those magical places. And before going there, I would have said it was magical because of the castles or maybe the green hills or the roads. And yes, all of those things are amazing. But the best part about Scotland to me will always be the relationships I made with the people I met while I was there. So here's to the jokes we shared, the prayers we've said together, the dreams we've talked about, the work we've done, and the life we've experienced together. You are all with me now, and always will be. So in the words of the great Scottish poet Sir Walter Scott, When true friends meet in adverse hour, tis like a sunbeam through a shower, a watery way an instant scene, the darkly closing clouds between. It's absolutely amazing. It's filled my soul back up again with love and creativity and just goodness and freedom. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for watching all my Scotland vlogs, everybody. We'll be back to our Minnesota vlogs shortly. And who knows what else. Loads of fun coming up on that side show. Thanks for tuning in to all my wee Scottish, Scottish vlogs. If you haven't seen them all, make sure you check them out. I guess we'll see you next time, everybody. Match Red Show. Like, subscribe, and share. And if nothing else, have yourself a bunny bar brick day from Matt's Red Show here in Wee Scotland. Love you guys. We'll talk to you later. Okay, bye.